first of all, Vi what's this? Vivian? Vivi Girl, I don't know. <laughs> to go to the home. What's up y'all? I'm 100% sure that none of y'all were expecting me to see me on this camera. But look, here I am. But today is a special day because this is actually my first time actually recording something without Justin being here. So it was like really, really like exciting for me. You know, I know vlogging and content creating is something that Justin takes seriously and something that's a passion of his. So I bet whenever he sees this video and hopefully he thinks I do good, He's gonna be super, super proud of me. But I wanted to show you guys pretty much uh, all of the things that we got from HEB. So Justin, he did a curbside order. So Justin did a curbside order on, you know, you guys through the uh, HEB app. So we got some produce, he got some of my favorite snacks. Um, we got some more produce, some broccoli, some carrots, some lettuce, strawberries, buns, some more snacks. And there's a couple of other things in the basket that I still have left to unpack. Let's all just keep it honest. When it comes to organizing the kitchen, the closet, anything in the house, that's all me. Wait a damn minute. <laughs> Wait a damn minute. Of course, you know, I'm gonna show you guys. Interior decorating is one of like Justin's passions. So that's his cup of tea. But mine is definitely, you know, organizing the refrigerator as you guys can see. I have like from like our juices organized. Um, this is gonna get changed because I don't like the way this, this looks. So I'm gonna change that. I have this side of the door organized. Once I um, have everything organized into the refrigerator, I'll show you guys the end results of that. Yesterday, me and Justin, we did like a pre-fall pantry clean out because I was so tired of the way that our pantry looked. So anything that was expired, we went ahead and threw all that stuff out. So I have to go ahead and get the rest of these out. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I do that. And then of course, I'm gonna organize all of this into the refrigerator. But like I said, I am like super, super excited. Cause I know you guys are like, you know, where's Jordan? You guys wanna see more Jordan, everything like that. So here I am. Um, but yeah, Justin, he's at work right now. He's gonna be getting off in like the next two hours. So I'm definitely gonna have all of this done before he gets here. But I think whenever he sees this video, he's gonna be super, super surprised on how I did. Hopefully, hopefully you guys think I did a good job. Like this is ever, I think this is like my first time like holding the camera and like, you know, speaking to you guys. So it's truly, truly amazing. I'm a little bit honored. So it's really, really crazy for me. Like Justin knows uh, I'm camera shy. So that's one of the reasons why you guys don't actually see me a lot. But I did tell him that I'm trying to get out of that. So I forgot to tell you guys one thing that Justin is very, very particular about and he doesn't play any games. He does one, he does, he wants to make sure that nothing is expired. He doesn't give a damn if it's expired by like one week, one day, three hours. If it's past that day that the label says on the food that it's expired, he's not taking, it's going automatically into the trash too. He doesn't play when it comes to his produce. So if anything looks rotten, anything has a weird smell, it automatically goes to the trash. So I'm gonna go ahead and make sure all of our produce is fresh. I'm gonna go ahead and clean the produce, produce too as well to make sure it's fresh. Now I'm gonna start organizing everything into the refrigerator. Actually, y'all, I'm not gonna, let's do this. Instead of, because Justin knows how much I hate these boxes in here, I'd rather just, since they're individually, anything that's like a individually, individually wrapped snack, I just like go ahead and just empty in the box because it just takes up space and just laying out the snacks in an organized and neat manner. So we're gonna do that instead. We got some of these. These are literally, one of my favorite snacks. But yeah, y'all, this is so new to me. Like, normally Justin is the one that's doing this, but as he can't do it because he's at work and we can't wait to make the video because the food will be uh, pretty bad by the time he gets off. So I'm super excited to be doing this, y'all. 
it's different. You know, I think it's always good to like challenge yourself and kind of, you know, like, you know, don't be in a box all the time. Push yourself to like do new things and challenge yourself to do new things, you know, regardless if it makes you, you know, comfortable or uncomfortable. That's like, you know, one way that you learn. So it's new. And I'm pretty sure the more and more that I do this, I'll probably get better at it. Like I said, I don't know why I'm not camera friendly. But anyways, y'all, like I said, I am done. As you can see, we have emptied the wagon. So I did went ahead and get, got all of the groceries I put into the refrigerator. And I went ahead and put them into the pantry. These empty bags, I normally like to keep because sometimes I'll take like my lunch in one of those bags. And I also, if we get too many of them, I'll just go ahead and just throw them out like Justin, he hates those. So I'll just go ahead and throw them out and make sure to recycle them. Um, but yeah, other than that, that is my first YouTube video on Justin's channel. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys liked it. I don't know if this is going to be the beginning, middle, or end of his vlog. Y'all know how Justin is. So I hope you guys enjoy this and I'll see you guys soon. What's up, y'all? Okay, so I'm back, y'all. I don't took my shower. I got all my pajamas in. And I am sitting here in a new spot, y'all. I was trying to figure out a spot in this apartment to show y'all differently. And I just decided to sit the camera down and sit down here and... It just came out like I love these. So I just got done, like I said, doing my nighttime routine. Oh, I feel so good, y'all. And now I want to show y'all my Amazon packaging. First thing I got is this big package right here. Tupperware, y'all. Not Tupperware. Child, and I hate Tupperware. It is glass containers, y'all. So I decided to get on Amazon and pick out these Tupperware. Um, I keep calling them Tupperware, and they're not Tupperware. Glass containers to put food in, you know, fruits and things that I put. These are so cute, y'all. I don't know if you can really see that, but this is so cute. They have the locking on all four, so you could just unlock it from all four sides. Like, okay, so this is how it looks when it's closed, pretty much. And then you can click them from all sides. I got the gray, of course, one of my favorite colors. And here it is, y'all. They came in different sizes. They have like 12 of them. I can't remember the price, but I'll definitely have it linked for you if you're needing to, you know, elevate. Y'all, get rid of that plastic. Plastic's not good for you. And I know we got plastic everywhere, but if you can help it and elevate yourself, girl, why not? So get you some glass containers. Let's get on to the get on. So y'all already know I'm trying these new things out. I'm just trying to make myself feel better. I'm trying to take myself to new heights and you should too. So whatever that means to you, little by little, make sure you're taking care of yourself. Make sure you're making yourself feel good. So I am on this, what? I was buying pajamas. Um, I'm trying to get me a new bedding set, y'all. I'm just trying to make life comfortable as much as I can. I decided that because I'm already getting new pajama sets, that I need to also take care of my hair. Y'all, I don't know if I put the clip in, but I was telling y'all, you know, how I am just like over my dry scalp. I'm over just my hair being just dry. But I will say update that the oil, I don't, I think I showed it to y'all. The oil that I got from Walmart has helped tenfold. When I tell you that oil, it just, my hair has not been dry. It has not breaking off. It has not given me any problems. And so, I do recommend that um, oil. I'll insert it here is what I'm talking about. And I'm like, you know what? I'm sleeping on a dry pillowcase. I'm sleeping on a cotton pillowcase. Maybe if I switch it up and get silk, come on, follow me, follow me, follow me. Maybe if I get a silk or a satin pillowcase, this would elevate, you know, maybe it'll make a difference, you know, with the hair. So, I was doing my browsing, 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 browsing. And I remembered, um, Kyra had came up, she was talking about something about a pillowcase called Slip. And first of all, <laughs> let's talk about how Slip ain't cheap. I'm just going to call it what it is. It was not cheap. Um, but I said, you know what? It is what it is. I want it. If you want to look how much they cost, 
girl, I'll link the link down below and you can be shocked yourself. But I decided to go ahead and get two of them, two of the pillowcases and something special. So here they are y'all. I decided to get her in camel. I have not opened it yet. I took it out the plastic wrap, but I haven't opened it. So she's in camel and I am excited to open it. So let's open this together. Let's see what it gives. First of all, the packaging is superb. So I will say for the money that I paid for one, for one, the packaging is cute. It came in the box. Now, I didn't like that it came in that little Amazon bag. Okay, y'all ain't, I can't even get, I can't even get her open. Like, which way does she go? Okay, does she go this way or does she go this way or does she open from the top or is she, a, oh, she's a magnet. Duh, Justin. <laughs> Elevation, baby. Elevation, okay, y'all see that? She's a magnet, this is cute. There it is, y'all. Oh my God, it's so pretty. It says, sleep with us, tell your friends, slip silk pillowcase. Hint, the better you care for your slip, the better it will care for you. And what they mean by this is they had like the special shampoo. I haven't bought it yet. I probably am because at this point I got the whole set and I might as well get the laundry detergent to take care of my silk pillowcase. Um, and I also decided to say, what the hell, let's go ahead and go all out. So, y'all know me. I had to go ahead and get the sleeping mask. Y'all, can you see that? The slip, sleeping mask. They're all in camel. My room is camel. And I was like, look, I wanted to all match. So, why not get camel? Oh, my gosh. She is so pretty. There she is. Is it going to focus? Y'all, I'm horrible at this. I don't know why I'm acting like this. I think because my lights are bright. But there's the sleeping mask. There you are. You can see it. That's the sleeping mask, y'all. I will let y'all know if I see improvement. They say it's supposed to help with your skin and your sleep and your hair. And I'm all about elevation. So, I'm going to put the link down below. I think you can get these also at Sephora. Um, but I just got them off Amazon, y'all. So, other than that, I am about to go... Watch this, relax, and chill out. Um, I don't really have nothing planned tonight. Today is Wednesday, and I have to finish my project, y'all. Um, I think I have another vlog. I should be talking about my interior design project that I'm working on, and I'm actually getting paid to do. I'm super excited about that, y'all. I'm still nervous, I'm still learning, and I'm vlogging all about that on another vlog. I don't know if I dropped it or not, if I have it. Please stay tuned and look forward to that. It's going to be a whole separate little series. I'm trying to have daily vlogs and then that drop simultaneously so it can be, you know, enjoyable so y'all can see that journey. I have new furniture in here. I'm sure Jordan has showed y'all. Um, and I, I am going to do a full apartment tour, furnished apartment tour. I just need to clean up, get everything speak and span, candles lit, and have it aesthetically beautiful for y'all. But I am so happy, y'all. Like, doing this project has taught me so much. It's not easy. I knew decorating for me is not easy. But to do it for somebody else is not easy in the sense that, not that the my client is difficult at all. Very easy, actually. It's just you as the designer. I don't know if it's just me, but I be feeling like I know I'm designing for them and it's not always about what i want specifically it's what they want what they see so trying to make their vision come true through my eyes because essentially they hired me i'm talking third party i'm sorry y'all because they like how i decorate but i'm just battling it trying to make sure i get it and i can't put so much pressure on myself y'all with elevation can't take yourself so serious take your job take 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 your hustle serious but don't put so much pressure on yourself, so I'm learning that as well. It's just a lot going on in this head. Anyway, I'm rambling, and I'm about to go. I hope y'all have taken care of yourselves. I know I say that a lot, but it's very true, y'all, because I had a couple hard weeks these previous weeks, and it's because I was not taking care of myself, child. I wasn't doing the things that make me happy. I was just kind of like in this rut. But you gotta just pull yourself up because we are all human. So, with all that being said, let me go ahead and enjoy my slip. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> and I'll see y'all in just a moment. Bye. <laughs> She was on that song video? No, she was on a video. <laughs> oh. She was on that video, that meme, when she was talking about she was his wife. And her shirt said, wifey. Oh, yeah. And she was like this. Child Yanzi. Hey, y'all. So, I'm at the house. So, it's later on. It's actually not the... It's not... It's not a new day, it's the same day. So I decided to come back. And me and Jordan are on our way to, here go Jordan y'all. Hey y'all, what's up? I am on my way to the bank and Amazon to drop off this return at the Amazon store. I just came to check in, that's all. I'm gonna go, I'm probably gonna need some gas. Babe, you gonna top me off? Yeah. Mm hmm Anyway. <laughs> I will see y'all in just a moment. <laughs> Y'all, I haven't seen a red box in so long. I did not know they still had red box machines. And this is at a Walgreens. What they be selling up in the red box? Let me know down below. Hey, you got it. Jordan doesn't want to go at home goods, y'all. He can't stand when I drag him up in here. But y'all already know I couldn't resist. Y'all, look at all the stuff. They got so much stuff. I have not been in home goods in a minute. I've been to TJ Maxx, but look at all this stuff. I'm so upset that I don't celebrate like Halloween like that. Halloween is still 60 days old. Right. Come on, y'all. Let's go this way. Oh, y'all. They got some neutral stuff. They got some neutrals. The music is playing very loud, so I'm trying to talk over it. But let's see what they got. This is really cute. I like this bag. Because homegirls make this stuff, but they get it from different vendors. Uh, I'm, uh, you know what? I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. I love this. I actually really, really like this, y'all. This is really, really cute. Y'all, we came, we found the candles. They have so many different fall candles. I'm not really into the fall scents that much. Jordan don't like them either. So, this is a lot of pumpkin, but they're cute though, like stuff like this, y'all. I don't know if this is a candle or not, but that's really, really cute. That's a, a light candle, huh? Which one's really cute? Okay. Y'all, they're playing music in here, so I gotta go. Y'all, look at this mirror. This is the mirror, y'all. Oh my goodness. I don't even know how much this is, but y'all, <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Oh, it's $600, y'all. It's so big. Ooh, <laughs> so big. Y'all. Y'all, Home Goods got Christmas stuff. Already starting. Already starting, y'all. They got Christmas stuff. Look at this stuff. They got it hidden in the bag. They got it hidden all the way in the bag. Wow. A whole row of Christmas stuff, y'all. They got tissue paper. Everything. 
This is crazy. I like the boots. These are cute, babe. I like these. How much are they? They got them on the back? $69.99. They're $69 for those? Are you serious? You playing? No, I'm playing. I was about to say. He just. Look at him, y'all. Y'all, they even have doggy toys, like Christmas doggy toys. And what y'all don't know is me and Jordan, we might be doggy, doggy dancing that right, babe. I'm so excited, y'all. Surprise, surprise, surprise. <laughs> What you say, Jordan? I say, yeah, mister, I, I ain't buying nothing. I ain't gonna get nothing else. I'm done <laughs> buying. I'm done buying. Please. Y'all, hold on. So, we walked out of Home Goods with nothing. Absolutely nothing. And I'm sad. They had nothing but Halloween and fall stuff up in there. I know. They only had Halloween and fall stuff. And they didn't they did have that Christmas stuff which was crazy. But should I should I go to another one? Should we go to another one, babe? What are you looking for? I don't know. Never know what you can find. No. He won't let me y'all. He don't want me to go. Babe. Yes or no? To what? To go to another home goods. No. Ah, but guess what? I'm driving. <laughs> Y'all, we at Cosplus World Market. Look at all the goodies they have for the fall time. Look at Jordan. He just love it, huh? No. <laughs> Y'all, it's so nice. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I just came over here to browse. Ooh, okay. This is really cute. This one's cute, y'all. Okay. Hopefully, the music is not too loud. These are cute down here, the smaller ones. What you got? He got a camper, y'all. See, he That's loves it just as much as me. Oh, that do smell good. You like that? It's called sunflower saffron. Why do I feel like we had that before? I know. I feel like we did. They got some succulents over here, y'all. Okay. And hey. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Y'all, they have so much stuff in here. I love this chair. Y'all see it? This is a really nice chair. Let's look at the food section. Y'all already know when it comes to the food. What they got over here, babe? Something we need to try? Look at all the hot sauce. Mm -hmm. Man, last time that hot sauce we got was not here. It was so nasty, y'all. I think it was the, the truffle hot sauce. That was it. Y'all, when I tell you that shit was so nasty, <laughs> it was so nasty. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this, y'all. Oh, that's it, y'all. Don't buy this, y'all. Mm -mm. It was like a paste. It, was, it wasn't like this liquid, was it was pasty. It was very pasty. I didn't like that. See, here they are right here, y'all. They got all different kinds. They nasty. All of them nasty. Jordan, what you got? I was looking at this. I, I didn't know what that is. Just what you put in the gift bag. Instead of paper, so I can see more echo for this. Yeah, what kind of chips they got? Let's see. Avocado. New Orleans, potato chips, spicy Cajun. Craw taters. Oh, the only one I would try is the Korean barbecue, the bourbon barbecue, and the dill pickle. Buttermilk sweet honey. I, I think we had them before, babe. Those kettle bread. Look at this truffle and real Irish butter. No, no, just a no. Just a no. All right, y'all. Now we're looking at glasses. Who remembers these? I told y'all I had got them from Costco. I got these at home. And y'all, look at the gold ones. Give you a little gold number. That's Jordan making noise. I already know what it is. They got black dishes. There's so much going on. We don't really need anything, y'all. I just came to see what they had. We already have gold. 
Oh, we don't have the gold and black. Hey, that's such a vibe. I don't like the holder though. It's thick. It just feels weird. That's cute. What y'all think? Tell me down in the comments. Do you like the gold with the black? Jordan said he don't like the holder. Like the handle. This is so cute to me. I would eat out of these. Halloween plates. I'm kidding. I'm dead. You're sick. <laughs> okay. All right. I love that green chair right here, y'all. I absolutely love that green chair. And I love this white one right here. This is really, really cute. Y'all, look at this eucalyptus tree. This is really cute. I don't know how much it is, though. I have no idea. It's probably at the bottom. Jordan, is it at the bottom? No, it's not at the bottom. I don't have a price. Mm -hmm. We could price it at $4.99. <laughs> <laughs> Let's say we found something similar. Yeah, right. Y'all, we was debating about this chair for real. I was telling Jordan we should take back the ottoman and get this chair. And y'all, it's on sale and it's swivel. Y'all think this green would match? I'm gonna turn. I'm gonna go to this side. Y'all think it would match our um, our aesthetic? I love this chair. It's only one and it's thirty percent off. Y'all, you can't beat that price. So y'all, Justin is moving all this stuff out the way so he can sit in the chair. I like the chair. What you think? It's cute. Ain't it cute? Mm -hmm. It's wide enough. It's green. <laughs> Should we get the chair? Yeah, I like the chair. Y'all. <laughs> Say it quick. Last time Justin and I was here. <laughs> When I say this is something nasty. <laughs> <laughs> what is it showing? You are crazy. Okay, y'all. He it's, let you know. It's a prickly pear lemon. <laughs> Jordan is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> we chased it in the car. We threw it right. right okay, tell him bye. bye <laughs> Always, you never gonna do the basic. But you know the basic bit, so I see. Uh, hello? Y'all heard that? Y'all heard that? Y'all, look what Jordan got. Y'all remember in that last vlog, he had that big old drink. Mm -hmm. He wanted this daiquiri again, y'all. this daiquiri again. Do y'all have this in where, where y'all live? Frozen daiquiris. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> y'all. That's all we can say. Oh my God. Okay, let's get on, let's get on. We gotta go, back. Hey y'all, what's up? So I just got off work, y'all, and I went to Hobby Lobby. I didn't record in there because I was just really trying to get some, in, in, I was really trying to get some inspiration and I ended up buying a, a few things. So I want to show y'all what I got, child. So let me put y'all up on here so I can show y'all. Hey y'all, okay, so I'm back. I'm a little hot, so excuse me. I know my hair, I know it look crazy. I know it look crazy. I came because y'all went to Hobby Lobby. Now let me be honest. I really ain't in the fall, um, like to decorate. No, let me hold on. Let me change that up. I love fall. Don't get me wrong. I am a fall boy. I absolutely love fall. Hence why I love the beige look because it's just cozy. It's warm. It's inviting. It's fun. It's classy. It's neutral. You could decorate around it. However, because of the circumstances, I don't want to do too much fall and then have to you know, pack all that stuff up, y'all. But I did have the itch for fall. Like, for some reason, I was like, I want to spruce up, you know, change out some things, even for the little time being. And I just hate that, I hate the strong word, but I just don't like that fall. I mean, Halloween, fall, it's kind of like mixed in together. And then you got Christmas. Because it's, it's real complicated to me. It's like, how do you decorate? Because I know some of my friends, they decorate Halloween. And then they do a little bit of fall. And then they start on Christmas. That's like three consecutive months of you changing your decor. Don't get me wrong. If I had the space and the storage, I probably would do that. 
However, I don't. So I gotta do what I could do. And because of that, I went in Hobby Lobby and I was like, oh my God, it feels like you walking in a fall wonderland. Like Hobby Lobby really got some beautiful pieces, y'all. And you already know if you catch them on that sale, one week is 50% for some items and the next week is 50% for other items. So I walked in on it when it was 50% for like fall decor stuff. So the first thing I got y'all was some of these pumpkin, um, just like, I don't even know what you call them. Like, little pieces that you kind of put like in a bowl. Y'all, these are absolutely gorgeous. Like, do you see that? They have every color that I absolutely wanted. I love how they have the cream with the gold sprinkles, the silver, the, the gold. So I got two of these. Um, I think they were, let me look. They were $14.98, but you get 50% off, so it made them $7.49. And I got two of them because if you don't know, I have that white pedestal bowl on my countertop, y'all. And so I'm going to fill it up with as much of these as, as I can. And then if I have anything left over, look at that. Anything left over, I'm going to like try to find little pieces around. The house, just something small. I just got these two, but I also grabbed y'all this nice, like shimmery matte type of pumpkin. Y'all, look how beautiful that is. Oh my god, y'all, this was so pretty. Um, I don't drop the receipt. It was, it was eight. No, it was originally. I think it was 17. Yeah, it was originally 17, so I got it for 8.99, 50 percent off. And y'all, I just I was obsessed with it. I wish they had a bigger version to this. Like I was looking all over, like I want this one, but I would love if you had a bigger one because if y'all don't know, up here I only the whole time I only kept that one boss, that beige boss up there. And what I wanted to do was take the boss down and put this. Could you imagine a couple of these, like a big one, a medium, a small one, and like some greenery? Like, I really wanted to do this up. Like, I had an idea to let's make it like fall. Like, even if I don't do nothing else in the apartment, when you look up, it'll be like fall. But they didn't have it, and it's okay. I did get this because, if you don't know, last year, Target had these pedestals. And they had these in Hobby Lobby, too. They actually had a more... Um, festive one, it had like the arches and it was really cute, but I was like, I already have a pedestal. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this on my coffee table and I'm gonna put the pumpkin on top. It's gonna sit like that on the coffee table. So I'm gonna go over there and do that now. I'm gonna put some of these in and I'll show y'all the, you know, the look after I get done. Mind you, I'm not doing a full fall. I'm sorry, y'all. I just, I don't have the energy to, to go out. I, I really want to. Like, my mind was jumping. I was telling my friend that, like, when I went in Hobby Lobby, like, like, oh my God, I gotta hear him get out of here because they had so much stuff that I really, 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 really wanted to get. But I had to be reasonable. You know, we gotta be intentional, child. We ain't forgot about our yearly word. Yearly word or our year word? Our year word. <laughs> but we ain't forgot about being intentional. So... Let me go ahead. I'm gonna put the stuff on the table and then I'm gonna come back and show you. Okay. simple change can really spice up your area i absolutely love how that looks together like look at it from this way y'all it's so pretty let me lighten it up it's so pretty ah! <laughs> i love it i'm sorry i'm gagging okay y'all that's all i want to show y'all for now i'll be back 
Hold on, y'all. Here I come. Hey, what's up, y'all? <laughs> y'all, it is September 20th. Woo! Can you believe it's September 20th, y'all? And I know I look crazy. I um I told y'all before, and I don't mind showing y'all. I am growing my hair out. My hair does not grow fast. So this process is gonna be long. I miss my hair, y'all. I miss having my little curls, even though um, for the summertime, it's good to have a haircut because it's so hot. But when it becomes the fall, winter, and the weather kind of chills down a little bit. It don't get too cold here in Houston, but you know, just enough. I want to have my hair. I'm growing my hair back out, so hopefully by my birthday, it's like in full so I can have my sponge. But I got my hat on and I got my hair cut, my hair touch up, not a cut. A touch up is on this Friday, so hopefully I get that done. But until then, she goes on. Okay, <laughs> y'all, so I got packages and I want to show y'all what I got. I ended up getting some of these taco stands. Oh my God, we had tacos like the a couple weeks ago and I really, really wanted some taco holders. I seen some other people have these and so I'm late to the party, but I decided to get two of these. So I got some taco stands. And then of course, with everything going around, you have to have some Lysol. This stuff right here, y'all, I really, really like. It is the Lysol sanitization for laundry, uh, laundry sanitizer. But I absolutely love this stuff, y'all. You can get it on Amazon, I think it's 10 or $11. And then, of course, y'all know I got my slip pillowcases, along with my satin uh, pajamas that I have. And I actually bought some new pajamas. I bought the red set, y'all. I didn't show it to y'all. And I got it in extra large this time because my other pajamas are large. And I started to realize that either your boy getting bigger or the material once you wash it kind of tightens a little bit. And I don't like to feel restraint when I'm sleeping. So I got those in extra large and I absolutely love how they feel. So I got the slip. Y'all remember me telling you uh, probably earlier in this vlog or it was the previous vlog that I was going to end up uh, go ahead and get the detergent. So I got that. Now I got some more stuff that I want to open. Okay, y'all. So this is, uh, what is this child? I forgot what this was. This is some shoe, shoe deodorant. Yeah, this is shoe deodorant. I didn't, I forgot what it was. So y'all know Jordan stands on his, well you probably don't know, but Jordan stands on his feet most of the time at work. And those shoes, those work shoes, child, girl. So he asked me to get him some shoe uh, deodorant because baby, those socks being on your feet that long, it's just a lot. And this smells so good, y'all. So I decided to go ahead and get some extra strength. Well, I didn't I didn't know it was extra strength, but this is what it's called. It's called Extra Strength Limit Eucalyptus to spray in your shoes. And I heard all the reviews about it. I'm gonna show you right here, just in case you wanna pick some up. This is also on Amazon. The reviews are really good. It said that all you gotta do is do a couple sprays in your shoes and it's supposed to last a very long time. The ingredients are very simple. Water, witch hazel, eucalyptus oil, peppermint oil, tea tree oil, lemongrass oil, clove leaf oil, apple cider vinegar. So that's some really good stuff. Y'all got all that in one, so you know it's gonna be good. And it tells you shake very well before you. So it smells good. I think he's really gonna like this. I'm probably gonna end up spraying some in mine just to you know, freshen up your shoes. You know, anything that has to do with elevation. So I got some of that. Now I'm gonna open up the next box here. Okay, and I also ordered him. Oh, I forgot I ordered him this. Oh, they already got it open. Amazon, y'all gotta do better now. Y'all know y'all be rushing, but dang. Um, I got him some Dr. Shaw foot spray because, like I said, he be on his feet all day. And I think this was like $4. I think the teacher oil was like 12. But I have everything listed below if you want to check it out. Y'all know I'm becoming an Amazon connoisseur. And um, if you've been watching my interior decorating videos, which will be dropping if they have not already dropped, I have to say it as if I've already dropped it. But if I did not, then please, 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 if you're going to purchase something, if you want to help your boy and support your boy, <laughs> click those links down below. It should take you to either my magic links or Amazon link. And y'all, when I tell y'all, I, I just have been obsessed with Amazon. They actually been getting everything right and I'm proud of them. 
Oh, I forgot I ordered these. Okay, so y'all know how you always lose in the back to your earrings? Say no more. I had no idea Amazon would have this, but they did. Amazon literally has everything. Y'all, these are 10 different backs to your earrings. So I'm always losing the backs. Either I knock them out or I don't know, they fall out. If you're needing backs to your earrings, they have every color, silver, gold. They have the rubber ones, the plastic ones, and they come in this cute organized container. Can you see that? Like, I'm telling you, order this. I'm late to the party, but I'm super, super excited. My girl, Summer Blair, just, it, she just did it for me. She went and got some spice organizers, and I know the girl's been doing this since, what, two years ago this became popular, I believe. Getting spice organizers, making sure your spices. Y'all already know how we do. Y'all, y'all know how we do. As an influencer, it's just a trend after trend after trend after trend trend. Wow. I was very late to the trend. Let me tell you, I have been wanting to buy some, and y'all know I don't really be in the kitchen too much, but I am elevating. And I'm like, Justin, I want my stuff to be aesthetically pleasing. Y'all already know I give the spill all the time. So I decided to cave in and get some of these spice jars. Y'all, let me show y'all how they look. So there they are, y'all, the spice jars. And here they are. And here's all the like the little fixings that go with them. And I'm probably gonna do this in the new apartment. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Okay, y'all, I'm back. It is so hot. And I have the air on, y'all. But I think because I had that hat on, it was just hot in here. So I'm probably not gonna do this in this apartment at all. I gotta be honest. I'm gonna do it at the new apartment because I feel what's the purpose of me doing all this? doing it. I could do that in the apartment. That'd be cute. So I have these. I'm just going to put them away. I'm super excited to have them. Make me go out and get some spices. I also, y'all, went to Sephora the other day and I got eye masks. Y'all, Sephora had eye masks on sale. I already used the aloe vera one this morning and I was going to vlog it and it, it was really, um, moist. Like, I loved how moist they were. Like, you, I was thinking that they weren't, they weren't, they were gonna be dried out. You never know what you're gonna get in these packages. And because I never had eye masks, I didn't know what to expect. But my mind was just saying, girl, these are gonna be dry when you open them, but they were not at all. I also got this one right here, which I'm really excited to try the, the caffeine eye mask. I had seen this one. And, and then this one is watermelon. So I'm excited to show these. Maybe when I do a self care, a maintenance type of video that's dedicated to that. You'll see me with the eye mask. I'm practicing, y'all. I'm getting into it. I gotta get into it. Y'all know my mind is everywhere. Between doing a decor project, I wanna do every day. I want, well, not every day, but I do wanna pick up the camera at least once a day, get some footage for you, and then try to do like designated videos. Y'all, I get so much support, and can I take a moment and say thank you all? I truly, genuinely wanna say thank you. I get the most sweetest, genuine messages on YouTube and or Instagram, however you may be. And I'm just like, oh my God, like, when you have somebody that you don't know, that don't owe you nothing, and I, I quoted this on my Instagram, um, and it said, strangers, be, be, be ready for strangers to support you more than, you know, people that you know. And that's the true fact, no shade to the people that I know, but, Strangers will support you because they're not obligated to. They can support you and not and, and not feel any pressure towards it. More so when your family or friends, mm, it's kind of this, they want to support you. How do I put this? They want to support you. They want to see you strive. But in the back of their head, they're really waiting for you to stop. You know, they're really waiting to see if you quit. That's how I'd be feeling. But that's that's just me. Um, and that's not anything personal or anything. It's just that's how I'd be seeing support. But what I'm what I'm saying is I really appreciate the people that message me, that tell me they're waiting on a video, that they've been watching my old videos until I drop, that they see me working on Instagram. Like, y'all, if you follow me on Instagram, I am active on Instagram. So my YouTube girls, I know y'all be waiting on the video, but follow me at Justin Stilo if you haven't on Instagram because I do keep that up to date of what I'm doing like behind the scenes. And um 
because editing, getting the camera and editing takes more time. And with Instagram, I can instantly upload. Although I love vlogs. Y'all know I love to do the vlogs. Anyway, I'm rambling. I want to say thank you so much. I love y'all so much. It does not go unseen. I appreciate all the love and support because when the times that I am down or I'm feeling like I'm not doing much, that motivates me to get up off my ass. Stay elevated. We all have our ups and downs, y'all. So, don't let this camera fool you, okay? So, <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and put all this stuff up and I will see y'all in just a minute. Bye. <laughs> I'm in your mouth, you're so good to me I'm in your life